Welcome to Mark Reed 757. Today has been a week since last time I made a video. I'm trying to stay consistent with this. I really am because um, it's important to me. And I kind of want to catch still the beginning to where it goes until the ending. And the beginning was 434. And the beginning was me hardly being able to put my socks on. Me hardly being able to get out of bed. Me hardly being able to walk an entire lap without having to sit down. That was June 1st. Today is July 1st. So July 1st, I not only can walk an entire lap around of what I used to lap a walk, I walked an entire 77 minutes yesterday without walking, without sitting down. To me, that's clearly amazing. Got some other good news. Last week I was 404. And this week I lost another 10 pounds. I'm 394 now. I cannot believe it. That is amazing. So, all together from June 1st till July 1st, I'm down a total of 40 pounds. So, in one month, I dropped 40 pounds. I know some people that haven't dropped 40 pounds in like six months or a year of trying. Well, is what they call trying. Now, granted, I upped my workouts. I'm working out two to three to four hours a day now. I did try to work out um, one to two hours when I first started, but throughout the day, but now I'm definitely up my workout. The Fitbit has been so amazing to me. Yes, I also did Weight Watchers. Uh, app, but I've kind of fallen off of that and I've been totally submerged into the Fitbit app and uh, let's see if I can show you this and with my Fitbit so I really enjoy using the Fitbit and all the extra stuff that they have with it it helps me stay on track helps me stay motivated I've been putting all my food in there I've been putting um, you know it automatically tracks all my exercise tells me if I'm swimming tells me if I'm doing sports or you know walking or whatever and I've been mainly doing that I did do one day of weightlifting yes last week I think it was Friday and I probably lifted the weights for 15 minutes and it did make me pretty sore and I, it felt real good uh, I want to start incorporating that more often but I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm getting in the groove. I've been mainly disc golfing, walking, and swimming. I swim for over an hour a day, a lot of days. Like yesterday was, I went twice. I went 40 minutes, then I went 50 minutes. Today I've already done over an hour. I won't go again today, but <laughs> I will go back tomorrow. And I try to do it Monday through Friday. Uh, of course, last week I also did it Saturday. But... You know, it's it's kind of I kind of go why how I feel, how my body feels. I'm always uh, listening to my body and seeing if my body needs more or doesn't. So far, it's been real good. Uh, anyway, I I didn't have time to put like all the fancy things that I want to do, like with the Fitbit and show a lot of the graphs and stuff. I do plan on doing that next week. I'm just really engrossed into losing this weight and trying to do the right thing anyway until next time um don't forget to subscribe turn that thumbs up blue and smash that notification button and the question for the week today is what do you do to track your uh exercise leave it down below in the comments until next time i'm mark reed 757 talk to you later